Did you guys call earlier? Uh, yeah, there's someone that's been Cool. Yeah, let me get in there real quick. Good. How's it going? How you feeling? I'm fine. I don't know if this went through. Yeah, 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 we should probably get that checked out. Control one seven five. Can we get medical to our location? All right. So what happened exactly? I mean, we got the whole story. We got so many stories, but you're gonna have to tell me your side of it. What happened? Where you ran to? Everything. Okay. If you want, we can go out and talk. That way, we don't get everyone all freaked out. Yeah. All right. My wife is with me. She's okay. Scraping. Okay. We'll get her checked out too. Okay. Uh, you would have to take a long way around. Do you have friends there? Okay. Okay. What's her name? Out to my car real quick. We'll talk because I don't want to get everyone too worked up more than they already are. Were you there too? You were all there? Okay. Okay. All right. Do you have your ID on here or anything? It was on my phone. Uh -huh. It's my wallet and phone together. Uh -huh. yeah, I talked to there. my sister. They traced it down. And somebody has it at this hotel. My phone okay, a Tropic there. Santa. Yeah. Okay. All right, let's take a walk outside, okay? Yeah. Are you going to be okay to walk? You don't want to sit down? No, I'm fine. All right. He's going to stick his trooper. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yes. Hey man, so pull that shirt, pull it up a little bit. I just want to see if it kind of looks like you got hit by 
shrapnel. That's what I thought too. Yeah, because um, <clears throat> yeah, it's here, yeah. here, here. Yeah. yeah, that's what it felt like. I didn't okay, and your imagine. leg? Let me see your leg real this, quick. This I think was from jumping over the railing. Okay. I believe because when I first saw it, it was like a cut. But okay. it's all it's tore. Because I know okay. I. Yours that might be shrapnel too. Is your ear bleeding? Kind of pull your hair up over your ear for me. Okay. <clears throat> Control on Sam 5, copy update. Medical is going to be for two. The first one is going to be a male. <clears throat> He's got what looks like ricochet shrapnel um, through and through on his arm. Um, he's got shrapnel on his face and on his right knee. <clears throat> Female looks like she has some type of overspray, possible shrapnel on the left side of his fur face, above her eye and under her left ear. Copy, thank you. <clears throat> Alright guys, what's your last name? It looks like spray. <clears throat> she just has it on her face. Yeah, He's got, it looks like shrapnel went through right there. And, I think this <clears throat> from jumping over the and then on his face right up here, it's kind of, but it comes out on the other side of his arm right there. <clears throat> Would you mind moving your, uh, <clears throat> I don't know if you want to get pictures or what all we want to do. Yeah, we'll do it just like a, a regular uh, 415 a victim. Uh, okay. I'm going to back call right towards and see uh, how we're right doing with these guys. Mm -hmm. oh. As opposed to like, you know, a different. If he's got something, how he wants to lump them in with the rest of the victims or if he wants okay. to do it. Or if they want separate event numbers, because I think you should put it on. I don't know if she connected it to this event number or anything like that. I'm not sure. Okay. I'll, I'll give 307 a call. Yeah, better than that, okay. right? <laughs> All right, ma'am, what's your last name? Would you guys, um, I know it's going to be tough, um, if you guys, you can tell me what happened if you guys want to read, because I'm going to have to take a report and everything, basically, this is happening all over the valley. Um, you guys are more than willing to write statements. If you're too, you know, shook up to write statements right now, I'm going to give you just a, an information guide with your event number, and you guys can be more than welcome to go down to the station when you're feeling a little bit more calm and writing a statement then. Um, but it's completely up to you guys. I'm going to get hopefully one of them. Do you get, does your guys' computer work? For uh, pictures? Because mine doesn't, I can't pull mine out. Yeah, I think I, I don't know. <laughs> our, our car's been fucked all night. We were where they were. So. Okay. So <clears throat> we're going to try and take some pictures. It's completely up to you guys. It might be better to do now because it's fresh. Um, complete, you know, like I said. So. We have to go to the stations. Mm -hmm. Our cars and the Mandalay Bay. Okay. With our room and our TV and all that. Okay. 
So he, he's going to get started on some paperwork and stuff. Um, just basically give me a rundown. I mean, I've heard on the radio, I've heard all kinds of stuff. So tell me what exactly, where you guys were at and what. what? conflicting stuff? Or huh? Just conflicting? Well, we're not sure. The more information we have, the better chance it is to, if we find out if there's one person, two people, three people, stuff like that, to make sure we have everybody that we need to have. So. Well, you might want to talk to them in there too also because they were saying that they were smelling like the gunfire from like a VIP area. Okay. There's a couple of, I think, two more. Oh, there you go. Off, right. off duty. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Well, <laughs> we understand, well, we got to get what you're going through. We were at the intersection, so we're just glad you guys got out. All right, so here's what we're going to do, okay? We're just going to stand right here. We're going to shine a light over on you. And we'll take a picture of you in general and then any injuries you have, okay? Then you guys can take care of the report ends tomorrow. <laughs> How are you going to do it today? <laughs> All right, I thought you said I don't want to call mm -hmm. the homicide lieutenant yet, uh, but we got to get a hold of McGrath from homicide.